Howdy, howdy. I got some shelves that I need for my garage in. I want it because I don't like this mess right I have going on here. So they should be coming in today. I got them off eBay because I like eBay more than Amazon for some reason. More of an attachment thing. But uh, So we're going to review this shelf. I guess you call it a review. I don't know. I'm just going to put it together and see if it is sturdy enough because this, as I'm surprised, is holding well. This is bendy. Hopefully this one's a little thicker. I saw the reviews on on eBay has reviews. Customers can write down what they want. But uh, we're gonna, it's gonna be about 46 inches. So uh, I need to rearrange this. Oh, this right here, this generator. I did a video on it. I haven't really put it together yet. Uh, but I had to get it going for the hurricane, which didn't end up needing it anyway. But it's a bigger generator. I, I don't know if I'm gonna put the video up or not. Oh, they come out that great. Might piece it together and throw it up. <laughs> Whatever. But let's get to uh, moving this stuff around. Get this out of the way for the new shelf. It should be taller, 70 inches tall, 40. So it might be better. It's going to be like a foot. It's going to be this narrow. So I kind of like that. That way it gets out of the way of stuff. And if I like it enough, I'm going to get another one and set it up on this side. And then make it to where it opens up the bottom. That way I can store more crap for all the crap I have. Again, let's get cleaning out this spot and you'll see it in a second. Also, if anybody's looking for a Chevrolet part to a truck, I have it. Um, Chevrolet PT part 37261754, part 37201802, or Powermatic, Hydromatic, Power Magic, <laughs> Powermatic, Hydromatic. Anyway, there's the parts number right there, if you can read that. And I have this Dodge Hub uh, cap. If you want it, let me know. Yeah, here's the package. All right, we're gonna open it and see if it looks nice. See the thickness of the middle, and we're gonna put some weight on one piece of shelf. Because it says it holds 2,000 pounds. Okay, which is actually a ton. Holds a ton of weight. You gotta stand on it to make sure it's actually durable. It gives me some promise that's actually thick enough. Actually, that's that's pretty that's actually pretty sturdy. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> it's a little flimsy. But it's way better than what I had before. I'm guessing that goes like that. It's gonna go like this. That comes with a hammer. Look at that. That is the worst hammer I've ever seen. Does it work? It does work, look at that. Huh. All right. Gives me a pair of gloves. <laughs> what do I need gloves for? Real simple. 
slide in the slots, bang it down. Hammer sucks, but it it's a hammer. All right, these are your little center pieces. They go, I assume, right here with these slots. See that old slot? It's right in there. And another one over here. There you go. And the MDF boards just slide on top. I think they're screws, but I haven't found them because there's little holes inside the center of the ports and on the frame rails that uh, have holes on them. So I guess you want to screw them down. <laughs> I don't know, there's gravity. Gravity's fine. I don't know if it's from me standing on it, but I can't complain, but that's broken because it's MDF board. So I think MDF board is cheap and I mean, it's a great way to save sawdust, I guess. I bet that's how it's made. Height, height. Yep. Let's see if it held some weight. We're gonna start with 80 pounds. So 40, 40, right in the center. All right. Then we'll do 30, right here. Let's do another 10. And then my last kettlebell is a 10. There's tag. That's, that's pretty good. That's, there's a sag in the middle. That's sagging. So, I mean, it's holding it, plus the oil. There's math involved here, so 20 and 10 is 30, 30, 60, 80. Uh, math. 140? Okay, 140 pounds on here. I could probably lay under here. Let's see. Distribute my weight evenly. It's gonna fall on me and kill me. <laughs> I am like 170 something. This works, it works fine. Works great. Okay. I think this will get the job done. Let's put stuff on the shelf. That box, I'm not gonna organize. I'm just gonna throw it up there for now. There's stuff I need to organize through it. I don't feel like doing it right now, so. But overall, yeah, 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 that was great. <laughs> Perfect spot for my cooler. Well, I needed a spot for my cooler. Yeah. Overall, I think I might get another one. I think. Um. I would only use two shelves. I might get two more. I don't know. It'll go all the way to over here. I'm not sure, man. I'm not sure. Hmm. There you go. Look at that. All right. Review. They're, they're pretty tough. They are pretty sturdy. Oh, I also got some anchors in case it tips over you know child proofing <laughs> okay bye all right put the boards on you just slide them on top of here that's what these little ledges are for all right that's what these little ledges are for you're not six feet from the edge you're just it's the edge edge not six feet from the edge <laughs>